Hello and welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video session, we are going to learn J Unit Time Test. Now, what is the purpose of using timeout? Suppose you are having one test case for which you want that that particular test case should be run within the particular amount of time. Suppose you want that login test case should be executed within 5 seconds. So, to check that kind of scenario which is bound with time, you need timeout test. For that, what you need to do, whenever you are writing any test cases, you need to give in bracket timeout equals to specified amount of time. For example, 5000. Now, this time will be in terms of milliseconds. So, your test case, whenever you are running any test case, your test case will be executed for 5 seconds and after that, it will be failed for the timeout reason that your test case is not being executed within a certain amount or given amount of time. So, you are bounding your test case for time and it is used when you want to check for performance testing. So, this is the way we are using timeout. Now, we will see practically how actually it is going to be executed. So, let us see how time test works in J unit test framework. So, over here we have created one class that is message util.java and we have created one data member that is message that is of type string for that we have created one constructor with one argument that is parameterized constructor and whatever message will be passing that will be getting stored over here we have created two method that is print message and salutation message print message is simply printing the value of the object and salutation message is appending high before the value of object and then it is printing the salutation message in test g unit we are creating two test cases that is we are checking whether the print message is proper or not and whether the salutation message is proper or not so we are asserting this two thing and we are checking giving the time out of 500 second and check whether it is working properly or not so in test runner we have imported test j unit file so using this runner class we will be running this application now according to our requirement this j unit test this test should be completed before 500 milliseconds so 0.5 seconds if it is not it will be throwing an error so let's see if it works properly or not so just right click on this test runner click on run as click on java application now as the message is not executed or the test is not started before 500 milliseconds you will be having error message and your test case will be failed so this is how you can use time taste with your test cases in test unit to bound your test case with the particular amount of time and for that you need to pass this timeout value with the annotation at the red test. This is how we execute time test. Thank you.